Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make this bracelet, which actually hasn't been named yet. And I don't know if it's focusing. Much better, I guess. Um, and this is designed by at, um, MDL Looms, and I would bring up his page, but I film on my phone. So I can't, but you should check out his photos. He is a awesome loomer, and... Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I have to actually ask him what the name of this is because um, I don't know. But I will be showing you how to make this. So you're gonna need a hook, some bands, and a C clip. I don't know if my C clip is right there. Right my hook. This bracelet is fairly thin, so I don't think you really need a double ended hook, but I'm gonna use one anyways. So uh, actually, I don't know what colors I'm using for what yet. So I'll be using these three colors, but I think for the um, just wrote the band. Um, for the white, it's still gonna be white, and then for these, I think I'm gonna do neon yellow and then gold for the middle pink one. So green will be neon yellow, and then the pink will be gold. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So to start, I'm gonna make a cat band on your hook. Pull the band through and pick up both the loops. And then I'm just gonna pull one more through this side. Well, I should explain that better. I'll show you better on the other side when I'm flipping. So you flip it after that. This is a basic, I think it's a six loop setup, so if you know how to do that, yeah. So you pull it through the first two and then pick up the other one. Just make sure it's not the cat band because sometimes the cat band moves. So now you're going to get the color you want for the green part, which I'm using neon yellow for. Actually, I think I'm going to switch it to gold. Yeah, I'm going to do gold. So you're going to pull through the first two and pick out the other one again. Flip and do this again. I'm going off camera to flip because I'm terrible at flipping. Okay, and then you're gonna, uh, you're gonna do the same thing to the side, pull through the first two, and pick up the outer one. So now you're gonna get the color you want for the pink band in the middle, which is neon yellow. I'm hoping this looks okay. I never, I'm so undecisive with color combos. And you're gonna pull it through the first six. Seven bands. Okay, I was counting. So you can pull it through all those. And then you're just going to pick up the gold one. So, oops. i do that. Um, You're just going to pick up the gold one. So, bands. Two. I think it's, yeah, two. Then you leave the middle two. And you get the other one. And I kind of rearrange before I put it on my hook, but you should rearrange this one to the outside. And... Yeah, so basically you're just picking up the gold bands and dropping all the white ones. So now you're going to move this one to the outside. Like that. Then you're going to get a white band. Pull it through the first three bands. I dropped it. And pick up the neon yellow. I'm so terrible when it comes to counting bands and telling which ones to pick you up, so I'm going to kind of go by colors, I think. Might be better. So you can do the same thing to this side. Move this one over to the outside of the yellow one. I just went back. So just pull it over. Pull it through the first three and pick up the neon yellow. Okay. I'm trying to see if I remember how to do this. I made, it yes I made one yesterday, but yeah. Okay, so now you pull this uh, gold band through the first two and pick up the white. Do that same thing to the other side. Through the first two and pick up the white. And now you're going to get your... Get, uh, I'm so tongue-tied today. Get your... Neon yellow band or whatever color it is for you. Pull it through the first 
seven and then just pick up the gold one. So it's just like before. Like that. And next you're going to want to get white. And you pull this one over just like before. Pull it through the first three. And then just pick up this one. Do that to the other side. So this is a fairly simple bracelet. Oops. Okay, got it. Next you're gonna get gold band. Pull it through the first two. And then just pick the white one. Do this to the other side. So this is the last time I'm going to be showing you it, and then after this I will go off camera. I'm not going to make it fully the length of my wrist because, yeah, my camera kind of like times out if you leave it paused for too long. So actually, I, yeah, I'll pause and make it that long and then come back. So you do that to both sides. And now you're going to get your neon yellow band, pull it through the first seven, pick up the gold bands, or whatever color it is for you. Oops. Ooh, it went under a minute. I have to go off camera for a second because it messed up. Pull it through normally. I noticed that I pull things through really weird, so yeah. So it should look like this, and now you're going to get white, your white bands. So two. Oops, that one's stretched out. Like that. Move this one over to the outside of the... We'll move it over the neon yellow, pull white band through, pick up the neon yellow, and then flip. That was a horrible explanation right now. Um, do the same thing to this side, pull the gold one over the neon yellow, and then pull the white band through the first three, and pick up the neon yellow. Yeah, make sure none of the bands go over the other ones. That one's... Okay. Now for the gold, this is the last thing I'll be showing, and then I'm going to go off camera to finish this. Pull it to the first two, and pick up the other one. Or the white. Which is what I believe I said before. Do the same thing to the other side. I forgot to say that. Okay, so that's pretty much it. I'm going to go off camera to make it a bit longer and then come back and show you how to end it. Okay, so I made it a tiny bit longer, not much, but it is a bit longer. Oops, it's not focusing. That's not better. Okay, that's a bit better. So once you get to this point, I actually didn't see if that was an official way he told me to end it. I kind of watched it up to here and the photos, well, saw up to here the photos he sent me. But this is how I did it for the other ones and the ending looks fine. So I'm going to just show you how to do this one. So once you get to this point where it's the just the gold and then the middle band on the hook, you're just going to get a band, pull it through everything, both be the <laughs> both ends back on your hook, and then you just take it off and put a C-clip. And that's it. And then you clip it to the other side, this is like a very small one. I'm going to make it full length. I actually like this color so they came out. So that is it. For this tutorial, a bit of a, that was actually really quick. So, if you like, um, if you post someone on Instagram, definitely tag me and MDL. And, I don't know what else. I haven't done a tutorial in a while, so don't remember how I end these. But if you want to subscribe to see more of my Loom videos, you can. If you liked the video, you can like the video. That was confusing. And I think that's it. So I'm going to put my hand here. Bye. Mm.